it's in five sections and each section has like a different situation and a different set of performers and a different rhythm and, and a different tone so it's a series of um, yeah situations is probably a good word um, and I think it's about um, sort of unearthing the uh, hidden mostly emotionally based feelings in the in, in in the in the characters who are, are um, kind of all um, kind of like uh, examples of a kind of of kind of um, common feeling of confusion and sadness and desire and frustration and confusion yeah it just has five ways of approaching it and um, they collect into uh, into one approach kind of a fractured but approach that's all, all one I don't know c'est un premier film, euh, on, donc on a commencé à collaborer avec, euh, bah avec Dennis Cooper et à un moment, lui il avait écrit un scénario en fait pour, pour ce film, pour une autre version de ce film il y a, il y a plusieurs années, je pense que c'était peut-être il y a 8 ans et qui, bon, qui pour diverses raisons n'avait pas, pas été produit, n'avait pas été fait. Et assez récemment, donc un producteur l'a contacté, lui a, lui a proposé de, 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 de réouvrir le projet. Et donc Denis m'a permis de lire le, le scénario, le scénario original, et m'a proposé de travailler avec lui. Donc on a, on a réécrit le, le scénario et, euh, et on, a, on a commencé à faire le film. De, je, enfin, je pense surtout que c'est un film très libre en fait, on a fait vraiment exactement. Enfin, on a fait vraiment le film qu'on voulait faire euh, euh, avec, avec peu de moyens, mais, euh, mais, euh, mais, mais on, a, on, a vraiment, enfin, on a vraiment eu une, une grande liberté, pris une grande liberté euh, pour, euh, pour faire le film. We met each other about three and a half years ago, and we're very sympathetic with each other and had seemed to have very similar ideas and got along very well, and we immediately started working on projects. So. Um, there's a book that we're working on, uh, there's a documentary film that's a very long-term project we're working on, and we've written um, a possible television series and a, working a theater piece together. So we've done a lot of projects together, and, um, and but this is the first uh, project of ours that's come to fruition, and I think the probably film, I mean, I think we want to make a number of films together, so I think this will be the first of a number of, of film projects that we'll collaborate on. The film originally was a project that I was going to do on my own years and years and years ago. And it was going to be a porn film. And um, it was, and uh, it's, it's changed quite a bit, but there's the Four of the five scenes are, are, are the same basic scenes and characters, and um, it was it was um, always going to be about sex and about the idea originally was that it would be try to use pornography to subvert pornography and you know like to make pornography about not sex but about feeling and, and confusion. Uh, it never got made. Uh, no one wanted to make it, and, and also it just was a disastrous idea that it wouldn't have worked. So, but the film is in five sections because because of the the average the, the basic porn film is is usually in five sections. It's like that's the was the original model was it five sections five different sets of characters that was the original idea, and then um, uh, the or structure is really important. Um, I mean. Um, The first one is, I mean, is, is kind of like the most realistic one, maybe, or something, or the most um, narrative, and it kind of moves in a, in a very kind of normal way, and, it, and it's very quiet, and it's very still, and it's very deep and stuff, and it's, it's supposed to pull you in emotionally, and then, and then it begins to disrupt. The second one is very short and tough and very violent, and then, and then it begins to, the, then the film begins to, in the third scene, the the structure begins to become more complicated and it's a combination, the third scene is like a combination of kind of the deep stuff and then this kind of kind of like comedy coming in or something. And then the fourth scene is, is more comedic and then, but it's also more atmospheric and then the last scene is atmospheric and very, very still. So th it is very, very important, this structure, and it's supposed to work. I mean, I always think that um, 
that you kind of have to get until the fourth scene to really understand the film because it, it, that's when you realize how much has been happening stylistically and how it's how they all connect and stuff because I think for, for a while you don't really see how they connect but I think it, it takes time in the film to for it to, for you to realize that it's how it works together and how it they're all about the same thing about you know desire and and different ways of thinking about that or presenting that de manière plus peut-être un peu plus générale aussi le enfin le, 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 le film dans sa forme complète je pense que ça, ça permet aussi, aussi de faire euh, enfin d'avoir ces, ces cinq sections qui sont distinctes les unes des autres qui peuvent avoir des tons et des, et des euh, enfin, un côté aussi un peu physique enfin dans, la, dans les rythmes et dans les, dans les lenteurs et tout ça de, de, des, des caractéristiques bien différentes les unes des autres mais et tout, tout en ayant la possibilité de, de, de faire des, des ponts, de, de faire des relectures aussi de, de, on a, quand on arrive à un moment plus tardif du film, de, de, que, ça, que, ça, que ça redégocie un peu ce qui, ce qui, ce qui a pu être fait avant. Bon, je n'ai pas fait d'école de cinéma, j'ai fait des, des études d'art. Euh, donc j'ai toujours eu... Et mon travail, là c'est un premier film, je n'avais pas fait vraiment de cinéma, vraiment, je travaillais vraiment la vidéo et un peu toutes ces traditions de vidéastes qui utilisent la vidéo pour faire une certaine forme d'argument finalement euh, par rapport à la vidéo, par rapport à d'autres choses euh, tout ce qui est cinéma expérimental, tout ça et euh, donc là ça, ça, c'était aussi d'utiliser cette structure en, en cinq parties pour garder un peu cette, cette idée de faire un argument peut-être par rapport au cinéma aussi avec euh, avec, euh, avec ces cinq parties et puis aussi de pouvoir euh, déployer plusieurs choses qui sont pas forcément enfin, qui, qui seraient pas toutes rentrées dans un film c'était un peu une forme qui permettait cette liberté Thank you. merci beaucoup bah, Thank you much. merci à toi et merci au, au festival du film subversif qui j'espère euh, aura une longue vie <rire>